Hello and welcome to your new video on this channel. Today I have great news for you. Crawlomatic uh, plugin just got updated. <clears throat> Starting from now, it will support uh, visual content selectors for selecting which, which part of scrape, scrape pages uh, should be imported using the plugin to posts. This was pretty hard before because the plugin supported only uh, XPath and HTML class or ID inputting of these fields, which was pretty hard for uh, most of you. But starting from now, also, also visual selectors will be supported. So let me demonstrate this. Let's start with TechCrunch. So the plugin has two scraping modes. The first one, when you enter directly the scraped URL you wish to import and import only that URL. And the second mode when the plugin uh, scrapes multiple content. And this is the seed URL which should not be imported. Only links found on this seed URL should be imported. So let me demonstrate the second one, the multi-scraping part. So if we want to use the multi-scraping part, we have to scroll down and check the do not scrape start URL. Do not import also the starting URL, which contains the links. Okay, now if we are in the second mode, in the uh, scraping mode, we focus on this. Seed page crawling query type. With this, we select which links from the seed page we should crawl and import them. For this, before we had only ID class and XPath. Now it appeared almost also visual selector and if we click this then a visual selector will allow us to select which part of content should we import. So let's click on a post, any post it is okay. So if you want to re-crawl it just select visual selector one more time. and. It's okay. Okay, now to select the content of posts, content query type, auto detect, with the plugin will try to auto detect the content, all visual selector. And now you will see that the plugin will crawl a single post. And you can click on the content, and the plugin will select the XPath to import that content automatically. Okay, so let me show you one thing. If you don't select here anything, select disable in the seed page crawling type, then the content query type, if you click visual selector, will crawl the starting page. So this is TechCrunch uh, main page. So it will crawl the starting page and will allow you to select content from there. However, if you select here the seed page crawling type, you enter anything and point to something, the plugin will not uh, scrape the starting page anymore, but will show you a post example from where you can select which part of the crawl post to import. Okay, so let me show you a use case when you don't enter the correctly the links from where you, do, you don't manage to click on links uh, from where you wish to scrape content. Let me this, click on this. This is not a link. So let me click this. In this case, the plugin will not have links which uh, it can select for multiple crawling. In this, this case, if we select a visual selector in content query type, a, a message will appear that failed to crawl page for post links. Please check the seed page query, uh, crawling query type settings field in importing rule settings. Seed page will be displayed now and the seed page will appear. So in this case, the plugin will notify you that this is not correct. The seed page core, uh, crawling query type string is not correct. 
In this case, you should re-crawl using the visual selector. You should re-crawl this link and try to click somewhere else. Okay. Now, let me demonstrate you using my blog, the Code Revolution blog. If we click again Visual Selector, we will see that the blog is uh, loaded for scraping my blog. So now let's click uh, a hint for this. Please try clicking on elements that are highlighted, that get highlighted uh, the largest part of a single post. So don't just click on the title or on the description or the image. Click somewhere where you see that the most of the post, single post element is highlighted. So let's click here. Okay. Now we can go ahead and select the content query type. Now a single post is loaded because we selected correctly the uh, uh, scraping query type and if we hover our mouse we can see that the highlight changes we should uh, high, uh, hover our mouse until we see that the un entire post content is highlighted so this is how it looks like and same for um, title if you don't want to leave the plugin to auto detect the title, you can select the title like this. The same for featured image and date and category and uh, price. Okay. So let me uh, run this importing rule to see which post will be generated like this because i configured now the plugin to import the rat race uh, post that you saw so one post got generated and here it is <clears throat> and the plugin imported the Red race post also with featured image and if we continue to run this multiple posts will be imported from my blog also this plugin uh, update includes two more new features that you should check the first one is reverse crawling order so if you check this the plugin will start to uh, import and uh, scrape pages from bottom to top otherwise it will start from top to bottom so if you check this the late the uh, last post will be imported uh, first from the scrape starting uh, url if you uncheck this the first one will be imported first and another cool feature that i uh, added recently is this Repli replace words list you can define a list of words to be replaced with another word so word uh, the syntax for this is word and word to comma second uh, replacement word and the replacement word for this word so this is the word which should be replaced and this is the replacement word this is the word that should be replaced and this is the replacement word and so on come a separated list of this okay i hope you will enjoy this new update for the plugin until next time don't forget to subscribe to this channel have a great day bye bye